Hey guys, hope you are doing good. Welcome back to the channel and welcome to another video. Today we are going to see how we are going to find the teams which won three consecutive games in this IPL, okay, IPL 2022. If you have not seen the points table calculation of IPL using SQL, check the link in the description section. Have a look at that to understand the data set. So in this data set, we have the match number like the 70 games, which was team one, which was team two and who won the match, okay. So for example, game one, CSK played KKR, KKR won the game. Game two, Mumbai played DC and DC won the game, okay. Now we wanna see which teams had a streak of three consecutive victories at any point during the IPL, okay. How do we go about this problem is, we'll split it again into two parts, okay. First part, we'll try to identify the winners in each game, okay. So for that, I will just type match num, comma, the winner as such. I'll give it an alias name, like team, okay. And since they won, I'll give it a new like created column. I'll just put it as win and give the column name, say value or something, right? It's just arbitrary, doesn't matter, okay? So this will be step number one. So now what we'll see is for each game, whichever team won, we'll have that team name and also beside that the value will be win, okay? Similarly, if we want to find out the losers, what can we do, right? We could select same match num, okay? And what we know from the original data is, so there is a winner column, right? There is no loser column. But we had two columns, team one and team two, if you remember, right? So if suppose team one was the winner, obviously team two was the loser, right? Because this IPL, every match had a result. So we will say if team one equal to winner, right? If team one was the winner, I wanna see team two, right? Because they become the loser. If not, team one itself, because that means team one was not the winner, right? The if conditions, else statement this is. So I'll say this as again, I'll say a team, I'll give it the same alias name. And in this case, we will map it as loss. And I will say value, okay? From the same table. Cool. So now when I run this, we will get for the first 70 matches, the name of the winning team. And then from here, you see, first match loser is CSK and we get the same thing for the 70 matches. So the 70 winners and 70 loss losers names we have now, right, from this table. Okay, now it becomes interesting. Okay, let's put this into a with class. Cool, basically a temporary query. Okay, I'll say with AS, okay. Now observe carefully what I'm gonna do. I will say select team, okay. And there is this powerful function called group concat. Let's see what it does. I will do a group concat of value, okay. And also I need to order by match number because for each team I want to understand the sequence of their win loss, okay. So I will say order by match number, cool. From A, okay. And simply say group by team, cool. I will give it an alias name, say streak, right. Their winning or losing streak, basically their streak of results, okay. Now let me run this, let's see what we get. So we get basically for each team their streak, right? So for example, CSK lost the first game, second game, third game, fourth game, they won their fifth game, okay? That is why we ordered by match name to understand their streak. And to cross check this, let's go to the IPL data. If you see, I have filtered for CSK results. They lost their first game, they lost their second game as you see. They lost their third game, they lost their fourth game. And I guess fifth game is when they won, right? Against RCB, right? That was their fifth game for CSK. Okay, so same thing, we get the data, we verified it, right? So loss, 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 fifth game was win. Okay, so we now got the streak as well, okay? Now the question is, we wanna see which teams had three consecutive victories. So ideally, three consecutive victories means there must be win, win, win somewhere, right, in this data. So for that, what we can do, again, we can put this in a further with statement, okay? I'll say, just say with B as this whole thing, okay? And now all I need to do is I'll select star from B where streak, right? That streak should be like, so we need three wins, right? So I could say win, comma, win, comma, win, right? Something like this. So it could be three or more wins, but basically if this matches, we will find the teams which had three consecutive victories at any point during the IPL. So when I run this, now we get, I guess only few teams, right? So Gujarat, as you see, Initially they had three wins. They also had a winning streak in between, like 
more than three games, actually five games. LSG again, as you say, they won second, third, fourth match, right? RCB won second, third, fourth. Then uh, Rajasthan Royals, they had a win-win-win streak here, right, in between. Uh, SRH, as you see, they had like a long winning streak in between, okay? So all these teams had three consecutive victories. If you want to make it four, all we need to do is we will just put another comma and put another win. So four wins in a row. Let's see how many teams had four wins in a row. Only three teams, right? As you see, Gujarat had it somewhere in the middle. LSG had uh, four wins here, like somewhere in the middle. And SRH after the first two games, they won five in a row. Okay. If you want us to check if the team had five wins in a row, I will just add another win. And only Gujarat and SRH had five continuous winning streak. Okay. Same way, if you want to check if some team had like five losses, I will just say loss, comma, loss, comma, loss, comma, loss, comma, loss. And as you see, these three teams, right? KKR had five losses somewhere in the middle. Mumbai lost a lot of games in the beginning. And SRH, as you see, after the winning streak, they had like five losses, right? So very powerful way to find winning streak and losing streak of teams. Interesting question. So to just recap, what did we do? So first we split them as winners and losers into two tables and did a union. Then from that table, we leverage the group concat function to understand the streak, right? So we got the group concat of the value. Value is basically this column, right? It was win or loss. Also, we ordered by match name to put it in chronological order. And finally, so to find say five consecutive loss, we will just say where streak like loss comma loss comma loss comma loss comma loss. If we wanted three wins, we would put win comma win comma win, right? Then we know three wins continuous are there. So I hope you enjoyed the video. I'll see you again in another video. Till then, take care and bye.